morning everybody welcome back to my channel my name is louisa if you're new here this is such an exciting video so it's monday the 29th of november and if you've watched my last few london vlogs you'll know that i've been down here to do interviews with glossier because basically they're opening up a new store and i really really wanted to work there and i actually managed to get the job which i'm so happy about and that obviously means that i need to be living in london full time this video is going to be my first full week living in london and i'm so excited I actually don't have any Glossier things to do, but today I actually have quite a lot of things on. It's literally like 8.30am, which is why I'm looking really tired. Um, but basically, one of my favourite jewellery brands called Bijou de Mimi put a post out on their Instagram asking for some extra help with packaging orders because they had a Black Friday sale, so they have so many orders, so they need a lot more help. So I've offered to go and help, so I'm going to go over to their Notting Hill studio and help them package up the orders. I don't think I'm going to film, just because I don't really know any of the girls and I don't want to just be like vlogging in their faces but I'll tell you how it goes and yeah that's what I have planned it doesn't really sound like a lot but it is gonna be a lot um so I'm just gonna get ready hop in the shower and then I will be on my way to Notting Hill <laughs> Okay, I'm now ready to leave, so I thought I'd just do a quick outfit. I've got my Garni jumper on that I wear literally all the time. A Holly Berry graphic top, FC UK cargoes, and my Adidas forum shoes. And then I'm gonna wear my big House of Sunny bomber jacket and wear my brown Marc Jacobs bag. And that is my outfit of the day, and I will see you in Germ the Juice. guys it's been ages since I filmed I went to Bijou de Mimi I packed up so many orders but I actually had a lot of fun it was very therapeutic and the girls who worked there were so nice good morning everybody I was planning on filming my first week working at Glossier but it was very very intense we've had 10 days of really intensive training I don't really know a lot of it was quite secret because obviously we haven't been allowed to say that the store's opening because they're very like last minute when it comes to announcing things because they like a big surprise but I've actually got a day off today and I've actually got a very belated leavers event from my school this weekend so today I'm getting my nails done I'm gonna go and get one of my outfits for it and I don't know it's just gonna be quite a fun day so I thought I'd take you along because I'm working at Glossier I obviously had to get a lot of the products because they like you to wear the products so you can kind of give a very personal account of how they work and what you use them for and things like that so yeah i got my hands on a lot of the products but yeah so i'm gonna get ready now um, i'm not gonna explain my routine partly because some of the things i've never used before and i don't really want to like talk about them like i know them really really well because i don't secondly because i've got a call about something very exciting which you'll find out about soon <laughs> Hi guys, I got back from my nail appointment and nail reveal. Wait, let me show you my thumbs. I am obsessed with them. It's my first time ever getting acrylics and I feel like a new woman, even though it's really hard to like do anything with acrylics, but we move. I went to this place in Earl's Court called L'Amour Nails and Beauty, I'm pretty sure. And it was so nice, like I'd highly recommend going there. Yeah, I've got myself some lunch from Joe and the Juice. It's absolutely pissing with rain outside, which is really annoying because I need to go into town to get my jumpsuit. But yeah, I'm just having a little mid-afternoon break and then I'm gonna go back out and go shopping. So yeah, I'll give you a little Joe and the Juice haul. Got the Go Away Doc juice it's my absolute favorite juice it's like carrot and ginger which is literally one of my favorite combinations mm, so good and then oh my god i'm so excited i got the classic joe's club sandwich if you have not tried this sandwich i literally don't know what you're doing with your life it is the best thing ever mm. anyway i'm gonna eat this drink my juice i've been watching the new um season of La Casa du Papel, and it is amazing. Money heist in English. Sorry, I don't know why I said it in Spanish. Just trying to show off my Spanish IB skills. Anyway, I will talk to you when I'm on the move. Okay, so we've had to have a bit of an outfit change because of the weather. Sorry, I literally cannot get over my nails. Like, how cute are they? I don't know. So, um, I've got my Supreme hat on, my Hollyberry scarf, 
and my brown North Face and my Longchamp side bag. It's the updated outfit. And I'm going to go to Soho now because I want to go to Peachy Den and get one of their very like famous like Colonel jumpsuits. So yeah, that's my plan. It's already dark and it's literally five o'clock. Okay, I thought it was earlier, but yeah. Hi guys, so I've made it to my dad's office. It was so busy out and about, so I didn't really stay out for long, but I love getting fashion magazines and I really wanted to get pop for such a long time, but they were always out of stock. But the man in the magazine shop that I always go to went to the back and got me pop. So I got the pop magazine with the bananas on the front. It's actually huge, but yeah, I'm very excited to read it. And then I went to Peachy Den and I'm so excited about this. But I got the classic Colonel jumpsuit. I'm not really showing it very well. I'll do a little try on so I can show it to you later. But I got this to wear at my school event on the weekend. And yeah, um, I'm not really sure what my plan is for the rest of the day, but I will update you when I know more. Good morning, everybody. Today is such an exciting day. It's actually the opening day of the Glossier store. I'm so excited. We've been training for so long and the day is finally here. So big day ahead of me of selling Glossier products. Um, I'm gonna go in a bit early so I can kind of like show you the shop because we're officially allowed to because obviously we went in like almost a week ago now and we weren't obviously allowed to film anything because it was all very top secret. But now I can give you a little tour and I'll show you kind of what a day is like at Gossier. I think I'll do a more dedicated video where I talk more in detail about it, but not today because it's literally the opening day. Anyway, I've got to get ready really quickly because I'm in a bit of a rush and yeah. Okay, so I'm ready for work now. And as you can see, I'm not wearing the Glossier pink jumpsuit because we're not allowed to wear them to work, but I've got the sweatshirt on and the t-shirt that we wear. And when I get to work, I'm gonna change into my jumpsuit. And yeah, I'm gonna get going now. So I'm nice and early for my first day. <laughs> guys so it's literally been a week since i last vlogged and that's because i've been working and i went back to edinburgh for my school leavers event that got cancelled in the end but whatever it's a whole other story um and i was like editing the video and it was only like five minutes and i was just like okay i'll just vlog again just i don't know because otherwise my video would be a bit boring and a bit short so today i am not doing much i've had a very slow start today it's actually one o'clock in the afternoon but anyway, I've done my makeup, gotten ready in a cute little outfit, and I'm actually gonna go underwear shopping. The story behind this is because my Glossier uniform, which is like the pink jumpsuit thing, is low-key a little bit see-through. And me and my friend realized the other day that um, you could like see our pants. So I'm gonna go buy some underwear that's not gonna be able to be seen because I don't really want people to be able to see my pants because it's a bit of weird. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm doing. I might go and do some festive shopping. I don't know, buy some Christmas presents, things like that. I hope you guys are doing well since I last spoke to you, which was two seconds ago in this video, but in life it was like a week ago, so yeah. Sorry that the lighting is really dark, but I'm in Soho on some kind of dodgy alleyway, but we made it, I'll be fine. And I'm going to go to the Supreme store and get my brother a cool t-shirt because he likes that kind of thing for Christmas. And then I'm going to go and get all of my underwear. It's very exciting. Might do a little bit more Christmas shopping. And yeah, I just had some really nice lunch with my dad and it's already dark, which is really rude, but we both and yeah. I'll talk to you later. Lighting is terrible, hang on. Okay, I think we're just gonna have to deal with this dark lighting, but people, it's whole time. 
Most of this stuff is like Christmas presents. Um, obviously there's a Christmas present in there for me. But um, I picked up one of the Skims like bralettes because I've had a bit of growth in that area recently. And um, yeah, I don't really have any bras that fit me. And I got the really cool one with like the, um, with the Skims like logo on it, like just to flex and things like that. And it looks really comfy. And yeah, I'm really happy with it. Got it from Selfridges. They sell skims and Selfridges. I don't know. I was just walking around the lingerie section trying to find myself some lingerie and they had everything. They had skims so which is really, really cool. But then I was gonna get like the matching underwear, but they were like 25 pounds each. And I remembered like in Victoria's Secret, you can get like five pairs of pants for 25 as opposed to one pair. So obviously I went and did that. To be honest, I'm not going to show you the pants that I bought, and there might be weird men watching. Okay, the next thing I got was from Supreme for my brother. He's a bit of a hype beast, you know. Um, so, Stewie, if you're watching, do not watch this because I don't want you to spoil your Christmas present. But I don't really know if he's going to like it. I thought it was cool. I, he's really into like graphics and things. So I got this t-shirt with this kind of big weird face on it. I thought the color combinations of the, the print with the burgundy t-shirt was really, really nice because they had it on like gray and black and stuff, but I just thought this was a very nice color combination. So I got him that, hope he loves it. And then the final thing is something that I chose for myself um, that I'm gonna have to like give back to my parents to give me for Christmas. But I'm obsessed with Stussy and Birkenstocks and they did a collaboration and they still have some of the Birkenstocks in stock. So I was like, mum, I need to get these before they, they disappear. So I did, I'm so excited to like look. Oh, I wanted Birkenstocks pages. I was kind of deciding between Uggs and Birkenstocks, but I feel like I won't wear Uggs as much as I'd wear Birks because, sorry, I don't know why I call them Birks. I don't really know if we're gonna be calling them Birks anytime soon, but yeah, I just decided Birkenstocks over Uggs. And I got the kind of gray ones, but they're kind of like white gray and they've got like Stussy written on and they're just really comfy and I'm gonna wear them as slippers. Maybe in the summer I'll wear them out and about, but I think at the moment I'm gonna wear them as slippers. Also, the other thing I like about them is that they're like clogs and like in Holland, like where I used to live, like people would always wear clogs. And yeah, I'm really happy with these. I don't think I'm gonna be able to wear them anytime before Christmas. My mum was going to confiscate them and give them to me at Christmas, but yeah, that is what I picked up. Mm -hmm.